Ukrainian drones caused a new form of suicide among the Russian military. The ongoing war in Ukraine has taken another grim turn, revealing the depths of despair and hopelessness among Russian soldiers on the front lines, according to the Kyiv Post media outlet. It is noted that Russian soldiers, upon hearing the approach of an FPV drone, are holding unpinned grenades to their heads. If the drone misses, they throw the bombs away. If hit, even with non-fatal injuries, they release the explosives, leading to an instant, gruesome, self-inflicted death. This alarming behavior is an unambiguous indication of an army in crisis, demoralized, leaderless, and drifting. The lack of proper medical care and evacuation protocols have left these soldiers feeling abandoned and without hope. It is a tragic and heart-wrenching sight, a spectacle that stresses the urgent need for continued support for Ukraine in their fight against Russian aggression. It is clear that Ukrainians are not facing a motivated, well-organized and committed enemy. Rather, conscripts are unwilling combatants forced into war with no trust in their commanders or their comrades. No doubt, as soon as Moscow finds out about this quick exit from the battlefield, it will no longer issue grenades to its pawns of the war. Now is the time for the international community to redouble its efforts in supporting Ukraine's armed forces. They ask not for soldiers, but for the tools to defend themselves, weapons and ammunition. With these resources, they can continue to push back against Russian aggression and protect their sovereignty. The Western world must stand united in its support for Ukraine, not only for the sake of the Ukrainian people, but for the preservation of democracy and the global order, which, at the moment, is teetering on the brink. Ukrainian fighters have targeted a large number of military equipment in the territory of the gas station used as a Russian army's warehouse in the occupied Bolshikopani village of Kherson region. The military equipment detected by the Shark drone were hit by the HIMARS missile launcher and destroyed. Pol-21 radio electronic warfare system is among the destroyed equipment. As the warehouse was being used as a repair base, the equipment under repair were blown up as a result of the strike. The number of casualties among personnel is not reported. Да ну черным, блядь, дом бы не горел, да. Не, это заправка. А ну вот сюда чуть проедь, оно будет видно. Да, заправку. Вот петушня, блядь. Заправка мешала там, а? Вот тут где-то встань его. Или склады. А? Склады и заправка, да, там же была? Так, заправка у нас вот тут, блядь. Склады. Склады втащили. Вот ублюдки, сука. Римбаза Таталин пишет. А? Таталин пишет римбаза. Какая римбаза там не было никто? Ну там... вот это вот база, вот, ну там же техника это стояла. Субтитры
Sur. 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 Sur.